Two years ago, we were presented with a really big challenge. Can we take more of what God has given us and give it back to Him? Just to refresh our memories, here's what we planned to do. Through Planted, we will continue to sow seeds through our school partnerships and our youth and children's ministries. We will continue to grow strong as we support our ministry staff and maintain our sanctuary and campus. And we will continue to bear fruit as we reach out in Christian service. And through Planted, we will also pay off our debt. And with no debt, we will have more financial resources to sow even more seeds grow even stronger, and bear even more fruit for years to come. The money that we're giving to the church has, it can be used for better purposes than paying off interest. Um, we have so much more that we want to do. There, there's certainly a lot going on. We, we, we're touching a lot of lives now, but how much more can we do if we have that money available to us? Over 150 individuals or families who had never given before gave through Planted. And nearly 300 individuals or families said, hey, count us in, we're giving more. And the average increase of those individuals is 56%. That's amazing. Our God is such a good, such a good God. It's, it's a joy to see that we can give and as a result, lives are being touched. I think giving and to be generous is a gift from God. We, we feel like we're a part of something greater than ourselves. You know, maybe my you know, the, the money that I give doesn't in itself add up to much. But when the other people down the pew or sitting in our section all give together, you know, we fund great ministry. We fund, um, you know, our worship. We fund uh, the people that serve in the church. And um, it, it helps me feel like I'm a part of something greater than myself. It just make my day when I do something really important, like helping people. I, I like being part of that. We have 34 adults now serving as mentors through the Crestwood Leader Academy. We launched 345, which is a monthly event for third, fourth, and fifth graders and their families. During the course of Planted, we've had our largest VBS ever. We have the biggest confirmation classes Webster Gardens has ever seen. And we have helped more families who had financial need so that their kids could attend our school. It's just an opportunity to touch a lot of lives in, the, in right here in our community. You know, it's an investment. It's, it's worth it to, to, to see people's lives change and to see people's lives go on a different path. Yeah. Little by little, they all of a sudden, you know, the, the next thing, they're, they're getting baptized. I don't even know how many kids have been baptized. The good thing about it is that we can you know, learn things from other parents as well about what they're doing with their kids uh, to teach them the faith and to, um, you know, integrate God into their lives. We've expanded our ministry with young adults. 350 people are growing deep in their study of scripture through daily texts or emails. And we now have 43 small groups. We like to be together to connect to other people uh, because when you go church, you just stand for like an hour right there. And then when you stay in a small group, you can have other conversation than just say hi. And then we enjoy and talk about our life and talk about our life in Jesus as well. 51 adults confirmed their faith in Christ. 64 adults and children have been baptized. And hundreds of members have served in our community, our state, and our world. I think it's one of the best outreach tools that we have to be in the community, to have a presence in the community, to be able to, you know, directly serve people um, in, a, in a tangible way and then get to share the love of Christ with them in the same way. It's a ministry where we can serve and show our kids how to serve without getting anything in return necessarily. You know, we are serving people because they need it and not because we're gonna get something back from it necessarily. We have made a couple of trips um, to Belize was one that we went to and I had never done anything like that before and that just, it touched on my heart. <laughs> Lucas and I went to um, Acuna, Mexico to do work on that Casas Por Cristo. And that was 
wonderful to do with Luke too. Two years ago, we stepped forward in generosity for one reason, so that more and more people would come to know Jesus. And that's still our mission today. You know, we have been given so much and as a gift of Thanksgiving, we give it, you know, to the church to use. And you just get back so much more. The more you give, the more God gives you opportunities to give. And it, it's also a privilege. It's, it's a joy to see that we can give and as a result, lives are being touched.